So within Power World, soon enough, uh, according to the recent roadmap, we will see new additions to the game in regards to those powers. But did you guys know we're actually missing a few powers that have already been seen within the trailers and so forth? There's also a power that's been found hidden within the game files, which is a fully made power model which does look incredible, but yeah, ain't in the game. But today we check it all out. Now, this past week I've been doing a giveaway, I've been running a giveaway uh, for a chance to win this game. The winners can be seen on screen. If you are a winner, hit me up on my Discord, which is linked down below, and I will forward you the game. Thanks everybody for taking part, and I am doing another giveaway. Same rules, simply like this video, leave a comment down below, and make sure you are subbed with those notifications turned on. Good luck everybody. So there are a few powers that are actually missing from this game, but they are in the game files. People have dared mine the game and found them in the game files. These powers, no one has discovered them right now. Some people, they are here though. Some people uh, think they're in the game somewhere. Uh, I feel them may have been removed and maybe added later on, uh, but we will see. Uh, the two I'm talking about are Boltman and Dragostophy, I believe that's pronounced. And now, these two powers, like I said, have been teased. We saw them within trailers. They are quite well known yet they are seemingly missing from this game. We don't know for sure, but many people believe they were removed from the game for whatever reason. I do not know uh, whatever that reason is, but Boltman actually looks like a real, quite unique pal. Him being an electric type, which is quite clear, uh, but also offering that kindling as his work suitability trait. And also the fact it states he drops flame organs by being taken out or tamed, makes you think, is he an electric fire type pal? which is super super cool. Now these details are known because they are also in the game files and it's why if you search for this Boltman on Google, the websites that have these details state the same thing too. There is even an in-game description of Boltman which reads, the more it moves, the more it heats up and the hair tips increasingly glow brighter. At its peak, it becomes so dazzling that you risk blindness if you stare at it directly. So where is this pal? Why hasn't anyone found him? Is he something that can be bred? Imagine that guys. Or is it a power that will be added on later in the game? And what we are seeing in the files is just a placeholder maybe. The other pal here, like I said, is Dragostophy. And now this dragon dark type pal is the only one I know of in the game. who holds both of these elemental types, which is very, very cool. And this one also has its details in the game for people to find too. Yet it's missing from the actual game. We don't know where it is. Now what I feel is, is maybe two powers added in the future. As the roadmap suggests, we will be getting new powers in the game. I believe for whatever reason, they removed them from the initial game. Don't know why, but hey. But seeing as there are no empty slots for these two within that power dex, I really don't think they're in the game right now for us to even find. Although I love the idea of powers being hidden behind a special breeding pair, much like we see with a Frost Alien Nut. Also really interesting is the fact that this Dragostophy uh, can be seen within the trailers as an alpha world boss too. So for sure, whatever reason he was removed from, they had plans for him and let's hope we do see him again. Now there is a third pal that's been found within the files, uh, which actually doesn't have a name associated with it. The pal itself though, uh, people are comparing it to a version of Mewtwo and you can see this pal on screen now. And in my opinion, it looks absolutely awesome and it definitely to me seems like a dark type pal. I think this one was found by a dude who was making an interactive map and was exploring the game files and this popped out, a fully created model of an unknown pal. This one low, as I said, doesn't have a name tied to it right now and I don't think there's any other details with it, but it does look fully modelled, it does look finished in my opinion. This one as far as I'm aware was never teased uh, via any early power trailers, uh, so this one could be a placeholder for a future pal or even could have been a dev tester pal. We do see these kind of things quite a lot found within game files. Maybe it's a power that we'll never see in the future, but for me it looks so cool it would be criminal not to add this dude into the game. But yeah people, these are the three powers we know exist but are currently a mystery at the same time. Now, if you guys know of any of the details on these, do let me know down below in that comments section. I know there are countless items within the game files which add to gameplay features which have seemingly been cut or maybe just not finished in time for release, but we will see about these in the future too. But yes guys, I cannot wait for new powers to be added. My power axe is already full, I've got everyone in the game. Uh, but yeah, the more the merrier. They also talk about new islands as well within the roadmap. If you haven't seen the roadmap, you'll see that on screen now. 
and you can see right there it says planned future updates pvp which is i know something many many people are looking forward to i'll actually probably jump into an official server when pvp releases um it's my kind of thing i love it in arc oh, i know i'd absolutely love it in um in, in power world what i don't like the idea of though is uh because there is an actual a sphere in this game it's in the game files where you can run around and actually steal other people's powers and as fun and amazing as that does sound it's also super super cruel if someone come over and basically caught my own jet wagon i don't know how i'd forget about that so as good as that is maybe keep that exclusive to certain kind of servers and not use it in all pvp if they do release that into the game who knows we can also see as well it says raid bosses end game content this is something to me that sounds super super cool i cannot wait to hear more about this there's no two which ways about that uh pal arena pvp four pals i do like the idea of this too imagine a battle arena we can go like tournaments being held uh, with pals strongest power team wins sounds super cool to me uh steam xbox crossplay crossplay is a big big feature for many games nowadays and um, i cannot wait for it to be added into this it means because i was actually originally going to play on xbox but because i had early access on pc i've just stuck to playing on pc but all my pals all my friends all play on xbox so i love crossplay to come so we can play together various xbox feature improvements pretty cool i guess uh, server transfers and migrations uh, this is actually a great great feature it's something that Arc did quite a bit uh, if you're able to i don't know if you'll be able to take your bases but if you can transfer all your powers as long as yourself your character your xp your unlocks and all of that to a different server that's a pretty cool thing i doubt you'll be able to take your base though because that's just i don't know how to even do that improvements to the building system this is something we definitely need i mean the building in this game is all right i'd probably give it like a six or seven out of ten there's so many improvements that can be added to it i also want more things i can build as well like spiral staircases and different angled roofs and things like that and then you can see guys they state new islands powers bosses and technologies uh, so yeah new powers new islands is what's most important here yeah? i cannot wait i cannot wait to see what they add into the game hopefully it's not just like two or three i hopefully they like drop a big chunk of new powers into the game like 15 15 and 20 that'd be great uh, some end game ones too some super super powerful ones too and some early game powers for new players be awesome but yes guys there we have it uh, another feature of the roadmap and everything that's coming with it that they talk about as well as what we spoke about earlier on in the video the three missing pals guys if you've enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one